How you all going today? All right, look what I got on the floor there. That's a brand new five kilowatt hybrid inverter from Dia. All right, so we've got it out of the box. Let's have a look at it, shall we? Now I've attached the Wi-Fi dongle already and removed its antenna. That's the antenna that comes with the Wi-Fi dongle. It just screws on there. I've removed that, but I do have an external antenna to screw onto there. So the signals will come out. It's got two MPPT controllers in it. Uh, that'll take a string each and it'll take up to 6,500 I think I'm not sure I will attach the documents at the end of the video so please watch it to the end of the video okay now this is a fanless unit that's where the fan used to be that's the outlet for the fan they make these totally fanless now because it's being mounted into my power power cabinet that I do have because it's a closed cabinet I do have exhaust fans and inlet vents. Okay, do not put this in a cabinet without exhaust fans or inlet vents. Okay, around, I'll move my coffee over. Around here we have the power switch and the solar PV switch. On this side, we have all the information. All right, now for Australia, these are on the approved list. Um, they can be used as a hybrid grid tie, no problem at all. Um, excellent for backup power, which is how, what I'm, I'm going to install this one as if I was on the grid. I'm going to use my other inverter as the grid and install this one and set this one up to run as if it's not going to feed to the grid because I can't do that but I'm going to set the times up so when there's peak and off-peak power you'll see how this one takes from the grid during off-peak and uh, takes power out of the battery during peak times and also if the power goes out and you've got batteries on these then you've also got excellent backup power Let's talk about the cooling fins. Now, why do I love theirs so much? Well, you all know I, I totally love them. They work great. Um, I've never seen any other inverter build of such quality. Um, they're a true commercial built inverter. Okay. Now, first of all, they're a one cast aluminium body. Okay, no vibrations. These are a low frequency inverter. There it all is there. Okay, some people think they're high frequency. They're not. These are a low frequency inverter. They do not hum. They do not vibrate. And you won't even hear the fan noise on this one. Although you will hear the exhaust fan in the cabinet, even though it's not much. This is where they used to put fans on them but they don't anymore. All right, let's have a look at the back heat fin. That's the size of the heat sinks on this thing. Okay, nine centimeters. All right, three and a half inches. Okay, and then that's connected to an aluminium housing. This whole housing is, acts as a heat sink because as we all know, aluminium is the best dispersant of heat there is. It just, it's a lot much better than steel. And yes, there are companies out there that do build their inverters out of steel and they vibrate and they rattle um, because it's a multi piece construction and even though they've got screws in them all those joints rattle and vibrate and hum and they make a lot of noise these ones don't make a noise the main reason they don't make a noise is because of the one piece housing and the heat sink 
and how firmly they're all securely bolted together. Absolutely beautiful. Now these are also rated for 100% humidity, guaranteed. All right, keep safe everyone. Bye for now.